Hey, in this video, we're gonna take you on a tour of one of the most popular two-story floor plans with Highland Homes located in Mustang Lakes community here in Salina, Texas. Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Texas Model Home Tours. Today we are in Salina, Texas at the award-winning Mustang Lakes Community and we are going to be touring this magnificent home with Highland Homes here behind me. This is their 222 floor plan, one of the most popular floor plans here in Mustang Lakes. You are not going to want to miss today's model home tour. Let's go inside and let's check it out. Hey guys, welcome inside today's model home tour. I'm excited to bring you guys another Highland Homes model home. This is their 222 floor plan here in the Mustang Lakes community. This is one of two model homes that they have here. This model represents their 60 foot lot series. These homes are sitting on 60 by 120 lots. There's over 24 different floor plans from you to choose from here, uh, ranging from 2,200 square feet up to over 4,000 square feet. So really excited to bring you guys this model. This here is a base home, starts as a four bedroom, three bath, media room, game room, study, with a base price just under $891,000. Again, that is your base before lot premiums, design centers, structural upgrades, uh, but that's a good starting point. Now, what I will tell you is the model home that we are touring today, which is absolutely stunning, super excited because we've got one of our buyers, YouTube buyers under contract right now on this floor plan with many of the structural updates that I'm gonna point out to you guys on today's tour. Uh, so I'm super excited that uh, we're selling this model with Highland Homes. Highland is one of my favorite, favorite builders to work with here in DFW. And we'll talk more about that throughout the home tour. But the model home that we're looking at today is 4,000 square feet, five bedrooms, five full baths, two half baths, media room, entertainment room, game room, and it is done up to the nines. And you can expect to pay somewhere around 1.1 million for what you're looking at here today with Highland Homes on this model. Here we have one of those half baths with your mud room. As we spin around, you'll see this is gonna be your entrance from your garages, currently being used as the sales center here for the sales reps with Highland. So again, you have this option here of a half bath powder bath, which I think is great because if you do have folks here uh, that are visiting, hanging out, everyday guests, having that powder bath is key. And this entrance is magnificent. It checks all the boxes, guys. Everybody wants these tall two-story ceilings, the open railing system. I love the archways here, the beautiful hardwood floors. And look at this awesome front door. This is a wood door, but the double door that elevation, there are several elevations you can choose when building. This is my favorite because of that double door. It transforms this front entrance, just gives you that high-end luxury feel. That home office, by the way, incredible built-in bookshelves. And then a first floor media room, but tucked away. Like this is such a cool room. Uh, again, one of my favorites here. Media rooms are super important in DFW. You're gonna notice all the best plans have media rooms, and that's because we are asked for media rooms by almost every single buyer. So you got a nice, dark, true media room. No windows in here. You've got your pre-wired surround sound. I mean, you could put a nice, huge TV, and then look at these solid core, thick doors You've got your double French door so you can close this off and really let this media room rock. If you're into movies, I like watching football in my media room, 
But again, nice size room you can see here. You could do this nice wraparound couch, nice tall ceilings in here. As we walk outside the media room, we're gonna turn over here and we are gonna come into one of our guest suites. So take a look at this. Uh, I love having a second uh, bedroom on the main floor. So this is a guest bedroom with full ensuite with the walk-in shower. So perfect if you have, you know, maybe somebody a little bit elderly who needs a guest suite with a walk-in shower, but a true ensuite because you walk in here and it's private. So you have a door and then you have this little hallway that walks down. You've got your bedroom, nice tall ceilings. Here you see the builder has done plantation shutters on all the windows. Plantation shutters that are a really nice high-end look. I will tell you, they can get pretty expensive. Walk-in closet. So perfect guest suite. Look at the thickness of these hollow, uh, solid core doors, eight foot doors here. They've extended the hardwood floors throughout here. Just a great job. I love working with Highland Homes, guys. One of the things I do wanna mention, uh, if this is your first time to the channels, I do not work for the builder. However, I've sold well over a dozen different builders inside the Metroplex. We've worked with hundreds of buyers and having worked with so many different builders, I've got a unique perspective that I can share with you if you are in the market. Uh, because I don't work for them, I can give you the, the good, the bad, the ugly, who's, you know, who's been great to work with, uh, the different quality of builders, what you would expect in the home buying process with the different builders. So I'm always happy to share that perspective. So if you are thinking about new construction and you've got questions about the different builders, the different communities, different floor plans, that's really where our unbiased expertise comes in to play because again remember the builder only gets paid if you buy directly from that builder so they're not going to talk about the other builders in the community because that doesn't benefit them but for us we do because we want to make sure that you end up with the perfect home that suits your needs and we can give you those insights with the different builders. Feel free to reach out to us. All our contact information is below every single video. You can always scan that QR code too on the banner of our YouTube channel. That'll let you get right into our Zoom calendar and book a Zoom call with us. Here you've got a utility closet, coat closet. You've got another closet. This actually goes underneath the stairs. So additional storage. What I love about this model is the amount of storage you have. You can never have too much storage here in Texas because we don't have basements. Here's your utility room. Spin around here in this utility room. Again, another add-on if you want it, but you can build and put a sink in here with the cabinets. It does walk through to your primary suite, so directly from your primary closet and into the main part of the house. We'll come through that way when we tour the primary suite. Here's your formal dining room. I showed you guys all those built-ins. I love this wine rack there with the two little mini refrigerator cooling stations there. It fully wraps around so you are here in the main entrance, but it walks right into the kitchen. And then here we are walking into your main living room. And again, ceilings shoot right back up to the tall two-story ceilings. I love the double sliding glass door. Those two doors open up from each other. So the whole center part of that door opens up, just bringing that indoor, outdoor living vibe together. Here we've got the floor to ceiling fireplace they've wrapped it all in the large ceramic tile kind of looks like a, a little a little bit of a marble look but i believe that's all ceramic tile but the nice three foot by four foot panels so you get that larger look 
And then here's your view here. Upstairs is open, open railing system. So you get that nice open feel. Here's your view. Look at that view, guys. Corner fireplace, the double door, wide entrance, and a large living room. Look, I mean, you've got four chairs, large couch, plenty of sitting room, plenty of room to walk around. Again, these doors, you see each handle will open. So you're gonna get like a nice eight foot wide opening, huge covered patio. Again, one of my favorites, guys. But one of the reasons people are moving here is so you can hang out outside almost year round. At least a good solid 10 months of the year, you could be outside. I mean, shoot, we were in the 70s and 80 degree weather in February here, so opening that out, barbecue and hanging outside. Maybe you eventually put a pool outdoors, but great space. And here we have the upgraded kitchen design. When you upgrade here, you get the two color cabinets. You've got the bases and uppers, and then look at how they continue all the way through into, we call this the casual dining area. It's not your formal dining area, but this is probably your everyday eat-in area. And they've extended this kitchen cabinet. You've got, again, your wine room there, more your serving area. And then I love the upper cabinets. They take it all the way to the ceiling, put a nice piece of crown molding up there. Here they've upgraded all the glass. It just looks very high end. Now you better keep your cabinets nice and clean if you do that. Don't overstuff them, but this is just a nice formal look, guys. This is what you would expect on a million dollar home, right? This type of wow factor, this type of high end finishes. Inside the casual dining area, you do have another door that takes you outside to your covered patio. So let's go out, take a quick peek. Again, nice outdoor covered area. Here on this product line, Highland is building on 60 foot wide by 120 foot deep lots. Here you've got the upgraded fireplace option. They will run your power outlet out here. So if you do want to hang a TV, uh, this lot is probably deeper than standard because this is on model row. So all the models are usually on upgraded lots. Uh, I'm guessing that your lot probably ends right before that tree. It's probably about 10 to 12 foot deeper than normal. So. Great covered area, nice height. By bringing it up a little bit higher here and adding those windows, even though it's a large covered area, you still get some natural light because of the size of the opening and the height. Let's head back inside and let's take a look at the kitchen. I know the kitchen is the number one room in the house. It's the place people spend all of their time. So you've got the sleek cafe style vent. And again, you have your options when it comes to uh, appliances. This is the cafe style. So this is probably gonna be an upgrade here from the builder. You've got your front apron sink. Again, they did the white cafe style appliances, but you can do stainless steel appliances. You can upgrade to the white cafe style if you like that look. Double oven, built-in microwave, pantry. Again, being used here, but you can see nice cabinets or Nice shelves, nice um, amount of shelving, fully wrapped around so you can store a lot. And then you've got additional doors here. So having everything wrapped around the counter depth refrigerator gives you a nice clean look with some additional cabinet space. And then look at the size of the island. It is huge functional shelves on the side. 
Okay, so no dead space, no just filler panels. We actually have functional shelves. Additional shell, uh, cabinets, I keep saying shelves, but you guys know what I mean. Base cabinets here, all functional slide out drawers and doors and storage. And then the nice little bevel and bay of the island here. Plenty of room for seating for four. And again, you got nice tall ceilings in the kitchen area over here. Pretty chandelier. All right, let's go take a look at the primary bedroom. Now this primary bedroom does have another structural upgrade that I wanna point out because I think it's something you should seriously consider when building and that is the extension. So you can see right here, this whole sitting area, right from the corner of this wall right here, this extension carries the roof line out, adds a window in here and gives you all this room for another sitting area. And more so important than the sitting area is the size of the room because this four foot, five foot extension adds so much additional depth and size to this room it really makes the primary suite, the owner's suite, just feel huge. And again, when you're looking at this price range and you're looking at this caliber of home, that additional size in your primary owner suite makes a huge difference. So this is something I would highly recommend you consider. Again, resale wise, having that, is really gonna help your home stand apart, give it a better feel. So those are the things also that, having done so many new construction sales, worked with so many of you guys as buyers from our YouTube channel, I can give you those insights and perspectives as far as what makes sense, where should you spend your money when it comes to design center, when it comes to structural add-ons, those decisions because that's gonna be important one day in the future and you're probably not thinking future right now, but as your real estate partner, I'm always thinking future because your real estate is an investment. At some point in your life, you're gonna to wanna to trade out and sell this and get to the next chapter or phase of your life and you wanna make sure you made all the right decisions to maximize this investment. And that's really what I do and I can help you guys. So we've got our split vanities, nice large vanities. They carry that same lighter wood feel from the kitchen. I love too that when you walk in here, your primary, eye, your eyes, your focus, go to this huge soaking tub. And then the window, the picture window that looks in to your stand up shower. I love how they recessed it and then decorated it with the faux brick tile. Here's just your water closet, but you do have another linen closet in here as well. So storage, storage, storage. And I have to point out this makeup area because I recently asked you guys in a question in the community, a survey like, is this something people actually like? And ladies, you spoke loud and clear that yes, you really appreciate this. So here they've done a great makeup area. They actually recessed it down a little bit lower. So it's more comfortable for sitting. I'm sure you could put your mirrors up there. My wife has one that actually mounts to the wall that comes out that has a light built into it. So I'm sure you could do that there. I love the board on board accent wall. Again, here they've done the plantation shutters. Here's your shower. Open up the glass door. Got a nice size shower here. They did the tile pan, which is a nice upgrade. And then the look through window 
all the way back to your primary suite. And then check out this closet. Tons of shelves and hanging and cubbies. Now, this center piece right here, this is more of a furniture piece, so this would be something you would add into this room. Uh, definitely nice to have the drawers built in here. Great little place to put some jewelry, but this is an add-on, so just keep that in mind. But you can see the size of this room with all the storage and built-ins. Super cool, different lengths of hanging. So if you have dresses, suits, you have all those options. And then again, here is the pass-through that we talked about from your primary bedroom into your utility room. Lots of closet space in here. Let's make our way back through. I always like this view as well to give you guys, you know, that view walking out of the bath into your bedroom. That is just always a pretty view, especially when you have a room decorated so well and it's so grand and large like this is here. It's just a pretty view that you get to experience and look at every single day. All right, let's make our way upstairs because there's still so much more to show you guys in this incredible home. I love the double doors. Leave me a comment, guys. Let me know what you think. Do you like those double doors? Is that something you think really changes the look and feel of a home when you walk in? Heading upstairs, pretty carpet. I like the design here instead of just a plain carpet. Now the entertainment room here, they've done the hardwood floors here. That is an upgrade if you choose to do it. I love the bench seat that they added in the windows. Take a look at the size of this room. If you wanted to throw a pool table up here, shuffleboard table, foosball table, cool little lounge area, you can do that. Another add-on you may want to consider is adding an additional half bath. As I told you guys, the model sits as a five bedroom, five full and two half baths. That is an add-on that you can have, which makes sense if you're gonna have people hanging out up here, maybe you're gonna set this up as a secondary sitting room, living room or game room, and you don't want people to go through a bedroom to get to a bathroom, adding that additional half bath on makes a lot of sense. Now, structurally again, remember we've added in this model, the fifth bedroom with an additional full bathroom as well. And those are structural because when you do that, it changes the roof line by adding the additional square footage. And here you can see this is a full ensuite same high-end cabinets that you see downstairs. Nice white subway brick backsplash wrap around on the tub there. Check out those floors, very pretty. And then let me show you the closet because one of the things I do love about Highland as well is the fact that they do have walk-in closets in many of their secondary bedrooms. And again, look, we're upstairs and we still have these solid core doors. So it's not like they just did it downstairs. They're carrying that high-end design and features all the way through the home. We've got the large baseboard trim. Now, if you aren't familiar with Mustang Lakes, in our channel, we actually did a driving tour of Mustang Lakes. Easily one of my top three to five master plan communities in all of DFW. Included in your HOA, which is about $169 a month, is your front yard maintenance. So you don't have to cut your front yard, you don't have to put mulch, you don't have to put flowers. All of that is taken in through the HOA. 
It has an incredible, incredible amenity center, a gathering room, uh, multiple pools, a lap pool, a gym. The gym here is awesome. Like you could literally ditch your gym membership. So Mustang Lakes is top end community with service to some of the best schools in DFW. Again, we're in Salina, but prosper schools. Here we are in another bedroom with full ensuite. Take a look at this bedroom. My guess is the biggest argument you're gonna have is who gets this room. Because this room has like this super cool sitting area attached to it. So a full ensuite bedroom with a sitting room, nice tall ceilings because you have a window here, plus on the other side, you're getting lots of natural light coming into the room. Yeah, good luck. This will be the argument. Who gets this super cool room here? As we move out, coming over here. Now I will tell you that availability with Highland is somewhat limited, guys. They have been selling like crazy and future lots and phases are not expected to be released until 2025 Q1. So if you know you like what you see and you're interested, you have to reach out very quickly, guys, because it will be gone. And with that happening, I can promise you what comes with the new phases is increases in prices. So if you are interested in getting a pretty good deal right now without worrying about the increase in prices and while we still have discounts and incentives, reach out because they are selling so quick. It's basic supply and demand. The more the builder sells, the faster they sell, the more limited inventory is left. They don't have to offer those discounts and incentives as much as when they're just early on in building. So those will go away. And with opening new phases, uh, we're seeing price adjustments and increases. We've already seen several increases in the base prices this year, just because of the supply and demand. So prices are always subject to change. So I always want to make sure we make that super clear. So guys, hope you enjoyed this tour of the 222 plan with Highland Homes incredible builder, incredible neighborhood. If you want information on availability with Highland, any one of the 24 different floor plans that can be built on their 60 foot series, reach out to me. We've got a great connection with the sales team here. We've got buyers under contract being built right now um, on this beautiful floor plan, as well as some other. So we've got great relationships. I can share with you guys discounts, incentives, and availability while it lasts. Just reach out below. All my contact information is there. And uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. I can't wait to read the comments about this amazing floor plan. One of my favorite, again, my client is building this exact floor plan with the hutch and the extended kitchen. I cannot wait. I will definitely be having videos coming along as that home gets further and further along. So appreciate you guys for tuning in. If you haven't, please do me a huge favor. Hit that subscribe button today. And when you guys do that, it really helps us out. It lets YouTube know we are delivering amazing content. It helps get this content out to other buyers just like you who are interested in new construction, many of which are coming from outside of the DFW Metroplex, starting their search on on YouTube. It lets them know we provide great, great content as well as I will say, if you are thinking about building, call me first. Your first call should be to me and here's why, because we can help you determine who's the right builder, what's the right community and talk about discounts and incentives. Again, that unique perspective of having worked with over a dozen different builders in the Metroplex, we can steer you clear from maybe the builders you don't wanna work with, as well as point you in the directions, what communities you should be considering, what builders you should be considering, what's the availability, what's the pricing, and what is the discounts and incentives we can get you access to. So start with a call, we'll help you put your home buying plan together, point you in the right direction and help you make your move and new construction build process as smooth as possible while ensuring you get the absolute best deal. 
Appreciate you guys for tuning in to today's model home tour here, Highland Homes, Mustang Lakes. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Leave a comment, let us know. Appreciate you guys. Make sure you hit the like button. We'll catch you on the next model home tour. Take care.